To be honest, I really don't care what other people think about blockchain technology. I'm not here to convince them, force them, or put the shot in their neck and tell them that you have to become a blockchain developer. It's a golden time. This is the advantage you will have. Like they have their choice. I have been in the industry for the last five to six years in the blockchain development, and I have seen the entire transition, the way it was started and the way it's happening. You will see we have trillions of dollars in the blockchain, in a decentralized ecosystem. If it's not good, then why people are investing, why there are multiple projects are involving. So I'm not here to prove someone that this is the technology which they have to learn. They have their choice. It's come down to you that what do you think about the blockchain technology? What research you have done? Why you think that blockchain technology is not good? What's the problem you will face in the blockchain technology? I do understand it has some limitation, but you can see there is a constant improvement is happening in layer one, layer two. We have so many blockchains. So the improvements are taking place. It's not going to happen in one night. It will take time. And the same thing happened with all the technology which you utilize right now. And those who say that this is what you have to learn. It takes time to get improved. So it's come down to you that whether you want to become a blockchain developer. If yes, then you have to focus on learning. You should never focus what other people talk about it. It's all come down to your interest. If you don't have interest in blockchain development, then definitely it's not for you. If you start learning and forcing yourself to learn blockchain development, you will go nowhere because it's just like other development field. If you want to be blockchain developer, you have to be good. Then someone will hire you for the project and you will get a job and internship. It's just like other developer field we have. So you have to make your own decision. You have to do a proper research before you take someone's opinion. I never say that this is the actual fact which you have to follow. I give my opinion through this video. It's ultimately come to you that how you take that as an advice or as a guidance and you do your research and then decide that whether you want to become a blockchain developer or you have to become a web2 developer and working on the other technology. So I'm not going to elaborate on this much because you have to be smart if you are learning blockchain development and you are in this state where you are, you are a grown up man or woman, you have a good intellectual, you can understand things and then you have to make your decision. When you want to take admission in any college, you do your proper research. It's exactly the same thing. You should never take someone's advice, some sort of opinion just like that. You have to do your research. Try to see what projects are coming up, what technology is good for you. Because in the blockchain, you have multiple segments, which one you have to pick. So you be smart. Don't take someone's opinion. Internet is free. Opinion is free. So anybody can say anything. You have to respect them. But ultimately, you have to do your own. Ultimately, do your own. Listen from everybody, but do your own.